What's going on you guys? It is Wanny back on your screen to bring you a brand new video in Greenville, Wisconsin. If you are new here, make sure you hit the subscribe button down below to join the Wanny family today. And today we are going to be headed down to Southwest Florida, you guys, because we are going to be picking up the president of FinTech, you guys. He's going to be unveiling his brand new executive office building, and I am so excited. We are going to be the private limo driver for him. So today we are driving our beautiful Cadillac Escalade. This is fit for the president of a company, a very, very, very luxurious and sporty. So we're getting on the road right now. We are going to be headed to the burger house for breakfast. I am completely starving. Our refrigerator is literally empty. We have not had time to go grocery shopping in months. So we are gonna be stopping for some quick food at the burger house. And then we are gonna be continuing to drive all the way down to Southwest Florida. As you guys can see, it is extremely foggy here in Greenville. Hopefully the weather is clearer in Florida. I mean, you just never know what you're gonna get here in Greenville. The weather is either super sunny or just foggy all day long. So we are roaring on the road right now, you guys. We'll be arriving at the Burger House in just a second. I need to find my breakfast coupons because, you know, we never like to pay full price. So, oh, looks like I found a free breakfast sandwich. Uh-oh, it expired three days ago. Hopefully they uh, don't notice that and still honor the coupon. You know, it was only three days ago that it expired, but, you know, they better take it because I am a very loyal customer, okay? So here we are, we are pulling up right now to the Burger House, everybody. I am so excited for a good breakfast sandwich. This place is literally so good, so, so good. So here we are, we are going to take a look at the menu and see what they have. All right, let's see here. Hello, can I get one breakfast sandwich, please? And a cup of orange juice. All right, we'll pull up to the next window, thank you. All right, guys, we're pulling up to the next window right now. Let's see, where is the worker? He's running around. Hi there, sir. I have a coupon for a uh, free breakfast sandwich. No, I did not order five ice cream cones. I think you need to get your intercom system checked out. All right, thank you. Here's my coupon. Yeah, it's for free today, you know, love free stuff. Now, I just ordered one, and it should be $0.00 today, sir. Yeah. All right. Well, thank you so much, sir. We appreciate your hard work very much, and I am so excited for my breakfast burger sandwich. Thank you, sir. Have a good day. All right, guys. This smells absolutely amazing. We are headed on the road right now. I am so excited to enjoy my breakfast sandwich, you guys. Seriously, it smells amazing. So we're gonna be taking the back roads down to Southwest Florida, you guys. Apparently, there is a lot of traffic on the main highway in Greenville, so we're gonna take the back roads. You know, people do not know my shortcuts around the town because it is a Wanny family secret. So we are going to continue down this main road for about eight more hours. We have a lot of sightseeing to see as we go down through the states. And we are still riding in comfort. The president knows we are on our way, so he'll be ready for us. We have to go all the way down to his presidential mansion. You know, they literally just call him the president because he has built the fintech company from the ground up. I mean, seriously, such a genius man. So we are going to be driving all the way down to Southwest Florida, and we are going to be picking up the president. He has no idea what vehicle we're driving, so hopefully he likes the Cadillac Escort. The guy is very picky. And, you know, sometimes he does like to complain. So hopefully he does enjoy the vehicle. So we're going to continue down this main road. And we will see you guys when we get there. All right, everybody. We finally arrived here in Southwest Florida. And we are going to be picking up the FinTech President right now, you guys. I am so excited. We are driving the beautiful presidential Cadillac Escalade down the road right now. And we are going to be headed to the highly desirable gated community that is right down the road. And, guys... Seriously, the president is so excited to unveil his brand new building. He has been working on it for about 20 years and the building is finally complete. As you guys can see, there it is right there. He built a giant parking garage and a huge executive office, you guys. It seriously is mammoth and insane. So we're gonna be arriving at the neighborhood here pretty soon. And guys, the president is just so proud of himself for getting this job done in less than a year. You know, this building is over a hundred thousand square feet, so it is built to hold many employees. So there should be a few employees that are going to be here um, 
for the grand opening but it is going to be a soft grand opening where we only have a couple employees but we are finally pulling up to the house right now i think i just got a message from him right now on the phone let's see here the front door is unlocked all right we gotta head inside and we gotta see what is going on here he is ready for us so i think he's right over there good morning how are we doing today are you ready for your grand opening, Mr. President? I am so excited to see the employees' faces at this beautiful executive office that you have built. I mean, it is just absolutely insane. Well, are you all set and ready to go? Or are you getting some work done here this morning? Looks like he's working on his laptop. Come look at the blueprints. All right, let's take a look here. Oh my goodness, this is insane. It's got three stories, a parking garage, 25 offices, conferences rooms and guys there is literally so much in this huge building well you ready to get going mr president i think we are supposed to be there by 12 30 it's already noon right now so we better get going here right now i am so excited hopefully we can build a second building i know that'd be great i think there is some prime real estate that we can uh, develop on later down the road i mean right down this main highway but let's grab the door right here you're going to be getting in the presidential escalator let me get the door right here for you sir all right well let's get on the road right now you guys it is an absolutely beautiful day here in southwest florida as you guys can see the president has one of the biggest mansions here in southwest and it is just so nice all right mr president do you have a speech prepared for uh the new employees I know this is our brand new chauffeur vehicle. This thing is very nice, fully loaded 2023 Cadillac Escalade. Definitely roars down the road. So, luckily, he planned it out very good that the work is literally so close to his house. It's literally like a 30 second drive to work from his house. So, I mean, that is super nice. So here we are, he built this executive driveway here. There is trees everywhere. I mean, this is just so nice. This driveway leads to the building and I think we might have to expand down the road to open up more buildings down here. As you guys can see, there's plenty of land that we can use for another building. So here we are. All right, everybody. He even got superchargers for the Tesla vehicles that will be here. And it looks like a couple of the very important employees are going to be outside right now. Very nice Tesla chargers. All right. Hi there, everybody. Welcome to the grand opening. We have the president of FinTech right here is going to be cutting the red ribbon here. We got to get a good video of him, okay? We got to get a good video. All right, stand right there. All right, you got to cut the ribbon here. All right, guys, here we are. Three, two, one. It's official. FinTech is now open for business. Oh my gosh, this is amazing. He is so happy, he's doing some dance. Congratulations, sir, your beautiful building is now open. I mean, this is just so nice. Let's head inside, everybody. I'll give you guys a quick tour. This is the reception area where you'll enter clock in for work here at this computer over here. And this is where the receptionist will take calls. Um, have guests wait up here. I mean, it is just a beautiful lobby. Now, we have the executive elevators right over here. We're going to head to the second floor, take a look around, and we are going to explore. This is a beautiful office. There is wraparound views that go throughout the entire building. As you guys can see, there is hundreds of cubicles. We got to hire more employees here because we got plenty of cubicles to fill up. This will be my office right over here with the TV and lounge. And of course, this is the presidential office right here. As you guys can see, it has a beautiful view of the lake and the ocean as well. All right, Mr. President, plug in all your computers, get ready for business. We gotta show these two uh, employees around very quickly. All right, follow me. You guys will each have your own cubicle. All right, Mr. Chris, your cubicle is right over here. This is your cubicle, comes with a free FinTech water bottle right over here. Let's get started working and Mr. Jackson, follow me. Your um, cubicle is right here. Very nice. Well, you will be training some more employees so be ready for them to start next week, okay? All right, I gotta have to have a serious word with the president over here. Uh, Mr. President, can I talk to you in your office for a second? I have something important to tell you. Yeah, very important. Um, look at this guy over here. He is playing Minecraft on his computer. What in the world? All right, Mr. President. Well, if you have not noticed, that employee, Chris, has been taking advantage of the system. You know, 
He's been playing Minecraft just because he gets paid $100 an hour. He thinks we don't notice him playing Minecraft all day long. Yeah, I think we gotta call him into the office and, you know, fire him. What do you think, boss? I mean, he seriously has been doing nothing. It's unbelievable. I think he's using our PC to his advantage. All right, let me go get him, boss, and we'll have a serious talk with him, okay? All right. Um, excuse me, sir. Excuse me. Um, can uh, the president talk with you for a second? I know you're very busy working hard over here, but the president needs to have a word with you. Excuse me. The president needs to have a word with you immediately. Immediately. Oh, my gosh. Sir, I'm going to power off the computer right now. We're going to power off the computers. Hold on just a second. There we go. Now, the president needs to have a word with you. All right. Right this way, sir. Right this way. All right. Have a seat right over here. Uh, we have some important news to share with you. Have a seat, sir. Thank you very much. Uh, sir, you're asked to sit down. Thank you. All right. We are going to have a seat right over here. Thank you so much for coming to chat. We appreciate it very much. You are a computer programmer for FinTech. Yes, he is. He is a uh, programmer, not a computer gamer. Whoa. Sir, no, no, no. There is no reason you should be playing random games on your computer when you're getting paid that much money per hour. You do realize that, right? I mean, it is unbelievable. Yeah, with that being said, it is your first day on the job, but I'm um, not sure that we'll be able to keep you here. And you're fired without pay. Oh my goodness, wow. We have a very strict present here. Well, let me help clean up your desk, Mr. Chris. Follow me right this way. Pack it up immediately. Now, sir, how could you be the best worker in this company when you've been working here for about six hours? All right, Mr. Chris, off the desk immediately. Follow me right now. Follow me. All right, here we go. Right this way, right this way. Excuse me, sir. Don't stare. Don't stare. All right, we got to get a box over here, and we are going to be loading up all this junk. All right, let's throw in these file cabinets. You could take your base computer over here. All right, I will help you load that up into your vehicle. Don't worry, sir. Um, I hope you do have good lucks. I hear that uh, McBloxers is hiring down the road if you're interested. I mean, it is a great company to work for. All right, let's go. We got to escort this guy out of the business right now. We are going to load up all of this stuff into his vehicle. Right this way, sir. Right this way. All right, we're going to be throwing it in the back of the truck here. Here you go. Right this way. Thank you, sir. We appreciate your time here at Findeck and have a good day. Okay, sir. Good luck to you. All right, well, we're going to get back in the building. We have a little bit more work that we need to accomplish today. But, I mean, it was pretty hard at firing an employee today. Well, Mr. President, I just cannot believe we had to let go of that employee. A little bit sad, but, you know, we have to do what we have to do, right? Very, very sad. But uh, did you check the uh, weather? Because it is looking pretty dark out there. What in the world? I just got a notification on my phone. A hurricane is headed towards southwest Florida. Are you kidding me? Oh my gosh, there's a hurricane on its way. What do we do? Uh, boss, do we go to, is your house hurricane proof? Please tell me it is. Please tell me your house is hurricane proof. Oh my gosh, this is not good. Let's go, hurry up. We gotta go immediately. Get in the car, everybody. We gotta get out of here as fast as we can. Civilians are being asked to get to high grounds and stay indoors. Uh-oh, you guys, there is a hurricane coming to town right now. We are getting in our escalator. We gotta go, we gotta go. Come on, let's go, Mr. President, let's go. All right, we're getting in the road right now. My house is not hurricane proof. Well, good luck, sir. Good luck to you. We wish you all the best. Have a good day, sir. All right, we're getting on the road right now. We're going to be headed to the presidential mansion right now. We are flowing it as fast as we can. Look at how dark the skies are. Oh, my goodness, guys. This is not good at all. I cannot believe that this is happening. Hurricane is taking over here very soon. So we got to get to the presidential mansion immediately. Immediately. They say everyone take cover in your house, stay safe, and you know, you gotta pack sandbags in front of the doors so the house does not flood, and you know, you gotta be as safe as possible, you guys, because you just never know what to expect. So here we are, we're literally running through all the stop signs because we cannot get through this. All right, hurry up, open the garage, we gotta get inside, hurry up, here we go. Shouldn't have been playing games, yeah, that guy should not have been playing games. 
All right, we gotta lock up the house here. Lock up the house, hurry up, hurry up. All right, here we go. Hopefully you have a good generator here so you have some power. All right, luckily we got some power here. Ah, this guy's in your house. Oh my gosh, I'm gonna check upstairs to make sure everything is still working here. All right, guys, seems like everything is still working. Thank goodness the power is still working here in the house. We gotta make sure we bring some sandbags downstairs because it looks like the storm is getting worse by the minute. Look at how dark it is. Trees are shaking in the wind and guys, this is just unbelievable. I cannot believe this. All right, let's see here. We got the, uh... oh my gosh. Where's the president? Mr. President, where are you? Uh, what do you think you two are doing? I'm gonna call the police. Drop that TV right now. Give me that. You two, follow me. You need to leave right now. Uh, Mr. President, they are trying to take your TV. And how did they even get in here? Oh my gosh, guys. We got to get them out of here right now. Sir, no. You need to get out of here right now. Out of here. Immediately. All right. We got to open up this front door. Hurry up and open this door, Mr. President. They are literally locked in our house. We have the high security here. You two need to leave immediately. All right. There we go. Sir, you need to leave. Thank you very much. All right, well, it looks like some of the power, uh, Mr. President, some of your power is not working. Um, hopefully, the rest of the power stays on in the house. This is just not good at all. I cannot believe the day we have been hearing. Yeah, all right, let me get you a cup of water, Mr. President. All right, let's get some water from the refrigerator here. All right, here you go. Hope you're doing okay. Oh my gosh, they're in the back of the house. Uh, stay calm, Mr. President. You're okay. He's feeling a little bit lightheaded. Uh, oh my gosh. These crazy people are here. Oh my gosh, guys. This is not good at all. Oh my gosh. Mr. President, get in the car right now. Hurry up. Hurry up and get in the car. We gotta go. We gotta go. Hurry up. Get in the car. Get in the car. We are getting out of here. Mr. President is not feeling good. We're gonna have to drop him up at the emergency room. Guys, we gotta go, we gotta go. Hurry up, hurry up. There is major storms here, but we gotta make sure that the uh, president is okay. We cannot let anything happen to him. Oh my gosh, those crazy people are chasing after us right now. We gotta get him to the emergency room as soon as possible, you guys. Luckily, it is super close to his house. Oh my gosh, we are extremely worried. The president is never sick in his entire life, so hopefully the emergency room can take care of him and make sure that he is okay. All right, everybody, here we are. Mr. President, hurry up, hurry up, get inside. We gotta get you into a room very quickly. All right, we are going to be waiting here in the waiting room for Mr. President to get out, but I hope you guys did enjoy today's video. If you guys did, make sure you guys drop a like, leave a comment, and don't forget to subscribe to join the Wanny family today. Thanks for watching, everybody, and we will see you in the next one. Bye, everybody.